Alright guys, I'm going to be making a quick video, well not really quick, just a basic overview of the Minecraft 1.8 pre-release. This is actually version 2, which is a lot less buggy, which I'm really happy about. <clears throat> I got really sick of um, trying to smelt stuff and my Minecraft always crashing, so that's a good thing to get this thing uh, taken care of. I'm a second, I'm getting a bunch of Facebook notifications, so I'm just... Give me a second, let me turn my thing down. Okay, as you can see, I am underground. My house is actually, this is a little room, that's really it. Hold on, let me do something really fast. Boom, boom, okay. Cut down my rendering, Let's see frames. 50, 60 frames per second, that'll, that'll do. But basically, guys, this is, I have, if I found this huge hole in the ground, I'll show you this in just a second. Oh, it's night time. Let me go sleep. Sleepy, sleepy, sleepy. Shut that door. Shut that door. And sleep. But I want to talk about a few things. Um, for one, the hunger bar. I'm not sure how many of you guys have um, actually played the 1.8 beta or pre-release. But personally, I like the new Hunger Bar. It adds a new aspect to the game. It's a new difficulty. And there's a creeper over there. Yay, creeper. And that's called it. Let's go for the creeper. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I win. I'm gonna chop some weeds. I don't know, these are supposed to be melons, but to me, these don't look like melons, at all. Let's harvest one. Nope. That uh, was too soon. These things must take a ton, a long time to grow. Oh well, let's put this back in the thing. And let's continue. Okay, this is the actual, this was a natural hole that I found, and I basically just covered up with um, cobblestone from just all my mining and explorations and stuff. I gotta kill the spider real fast because he's not irritating with his hissing. Yeah, yeah. Ha, ha, I win. Wait. I am actually gonna take you guys into my little dungeon area. Um, I'm gonna go this way. Oh, and yeah, you see? You can block now. You can block in Minecraft. That's so cool. Okay. Walk up stairs. I gotta get me some... Hey, what's in here? <gasps> iron. Let's see how much iron I have. <gasps> oh my goodness. All the iron. All the stuff. All the stuffs. I got plenty of stuffs. I am going to get me... I need... One thing that I have learned not to do. I'm not gonna get wood. Wood, 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 wood. There we go. Wood. No. Oh, yes. Okay. Doom, doom, doom. You do not want to shift click then you, with the V2 because it will take all of the stuff and make stacks. So I just click and then I got a stack and boom, boom. And let's put that back. Let's make, hey look, I have tin gunpowder. I didn't even realize that. Let's go high. And let's go under. Uh huh. That'll work. Toss that back up. Pick it back up. Let's see, what else do I need? Uh, I forgot food. Put my gunpowder in here. Um. <clears throat> A couple aspects about the health bar, like it, a lot, it does go down over time. But I have noticed. I'm not sure if this is actually true, but it seems to me that as you level up, your um hunger bar stays up longer. So the green bar right below the hunger bar is actually the experience bar, which you collect the little orbs and things from different mobs. I don't know if there's exactly like a mathematical 
way to determine how many orbs you get per mob or if there's different like uh, mob categories that drop different kind of the different amounts of orbs I don't know but I still think it's pretty sweet <clears throat> I am actually this is one of my this is my favorite place so far um, I've actually hey there's a zombie coming down a hallway that's creepy let's <clears throat> I probably found about six different mob or dungeons or whatever you call it samba I win here hold up options sorry for the noise guys <clears throat> And that I do not like is over here. There are quite a few um poisonous spider spawns. See those little peckers right there. Get out of here. See that one looked like I only dropped three of the little orb things. Um, I'm not sure if, what kind of topics you guys want to be talking about. See, there's a little spawner right here. Let me actually lock that thing up. I'm trying to prevent as many from spawning as possible. Um, but, like, this is a mine shaft. This is not something I created. I actually found out. I was just exploring around, and I found this. Oh, shoot. You little freaking pecker. Get. Okay. Thank God. It used to, before, before this last patch, Notch had it where it would, um, it would take about half your health away. I'm not sure if these things spawn from spider webs. You freaking yeah, I need to walk away from here so I can actually heal. Yeah, I don't really feel like being down here. Oh look, my health bar isn't full. So I'm not gonna heal anymore. Let's eat. Yay, new eating animation. I love it. I think it, it does make it a little bit more realistic. I, I know that people are saying that Notch is trying too hard to make it realistic. Um, I really don't think he's trying too hard. I think it's actually a good thing. I like the realism of it. I would really think... I like... Minecraft was good. It's always gotten better. I just know some people aren't very happy with this last update with it being just... A little bit, I guess they're saying it's too realistic, maybe. I guess this is, I'm going to destroy these things because I don't want these guys spawning. Yeah. Bye-bye. Anyway. As I continue, I have saying, I'm pretty sure I said that I have found about six uh, ma um, dungeons. Excuse me. Um, and they're legit. I was wandering around. They're all connected to this mine shaft. This mine shaft is huge, might I say. Um, one thing I like that Notch put in here is the ability for you to find um different crates that have loot in them. I've actually found a couple crates that have had uh, iron pickaxes in them, which I like. I mean, it's, it's okay. Hold up. There's a one that just spawned. Where is he? I, I hear him somewhere. I know that probably some. There you are. Where did you spawn, you little pecker? Get out of here! The heck are you guys spawning at? I'm not going over there anymore, guys. That's just too much of a pain to freaking lose. Three fourths of your health over two little spiders. From what I've heard, that Notch is actually working on a nerf for these things. Hey, look, a chest. Oh, it's empty. I already rated that one. Oh, uh, let's see. Let's go down. And I am probably going to get lost. I just want to show you guys how massive these things are. Um. And what I. Back on the topic, I'm sorry guys, I'm really jumping around, but there's just so much in this um, update that it's hard to stay on track with all the new features and everything. 
one thing I really do like is that the fact that with the new hunger bar thing, you actually heal over time, even if you are on a um on a difficulty like playing with uh hostile mobs on, which is actually really helpful because I know many times I'm out and I get injured and I don't have any food with me and I just end up dying because I can't heal myself and I don't have any food. And there's a creeper. There's a creeper. Come here. Hey, creeper. Come here. Commit suicide. Come on. And you're dead. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure if you guys noticed that either. But if you double tap W and then you hit him, if you sprint while you're sprinting, you hit a mob. It'll actually knock the mob back, which is really helpful with creepers, of course, because it'll knock them back just far enough, if not farther, for them not to explode. And they'll just reset their little hissing timer, I guess you could say. But all that. Um, iron that you guys saw in my chest is legit because as you can see I am finding tons of it right now and you actually find in the chests around the mine shaft you can actually find diamonds which is actually really cool I've been the max I found in one chest so far is three but that's still better than nothing um hmm I'm trying to figure out where this one area was where I literally, I found, I walked one way and I found a, a skeleton spawner and I walked back a different way and I found a, um, another zombie spawner. So I'm trying to find those right now, which I don't think I'm anywhere close to finding. Let me get these iron. It's always good to have iron. But, um, I know that if there's anybody who wants to um, help me out and right now I'm using QuickTime to record on my Mac but if anybody knows how to I would like to be doing du dual comms for people um, if you guys can tell me direct me to a Skype recorder that's not that doesn't cost 99 bucks I'll greatly appreciate it um, no I'm saying I'm a lot it's just kinda of part of my vocabulary but it's one, one thing I was, I, I love is the Enderman. I know people are freaking, get freaked out by the Enderman just by the fact that they're scared to look straight at it, that it's just going to run towards them and kill them. I think that makes it a new challenge to the game. Instead of just it being there and you're like, oh, okay, you can look at it. And it just, or you be around it and it automatically starts uh, trying to kill you. What I like about this is you actually have to look straight at it before it turns hostile. Which to me, it's a lot more fun. It makes it a little more intense. And I have not been down here before. What is that here? Um, I had, I had talked was talking to a couple of my buddies before. And I wonder if he's, this opaque is gonna come up here. Come here. You can come up here. Doesn't look like it. Okay. But I was talking to a couple of my friends earlier today. And talking to him about that if once you kill Endermen, they drop these things called Ender Pearls, which are basically these little green pearls. I've only seen it drop once out of like five, six Endermen I've killed. Um, but I have an idea that if Notch added, let's say he not, Notch added ghosts, I'm not sure if Hair Brian is supposed to be a ghost or not. Let's say he added a ghost into the game. It'd be, I think it would be kind of cool to make it where you use Ender Pearls as. Like, you make a sword, like an ender sword, and that would be the only weapon that could kill a ghost. I'm thinking that would be actually pretty sweet, and having the ghost, ghost not drop anything, but they're always, ghosts are always hostile, or depending on what kind of, um, ghost they are. If they're, like, mob ghosts, which I think would be kind of cool, like, what I mean by that is, like, creeper ghosts, or skeleton ghosts, or if they're just, like, animal ghosts, or whatever, they only come out at night, like the regulars do, but... The ghosts just fly through things, and they don't really, like the creepers wouldn't actually blow up. The creeper ghosts wouldn't blow up, but they would actually just fly through and just injure you on the way through. Have I been here already? Yes. Here's a, wait. I think I just went in a complete circle. I don't, no, I don't think I did. But, um, 
or skeletons actually shoot arrows. They shoot, I guess, I'm not sure how you would really feel that out. I hadn't really put much thought into it. But just by basically with the ender pearls making the ender sword, and that's what you use to kill ghosts. I thought that'd be kind of a little bit kind of interesting, just to make an, each, an, another challenge for the game. And there's gravel under here. I hate gravel. Uh, if you guys think, ooh, what's in here? <gasps> See, diamond. I got diamond. Yeah, and gold and bread, plenty of bread. And there's dark this way. Dark. What what lies in the unknown? Water. It's a bit nice. Hey look, more iron. Hooray! I love iron. Who doesn't love iron? Okay, got it all. Let's go. <gasps> Another chest. Iron. Rails, melon seeds, which I've got a ton of those now. It seems to me that you can only find melon seeds while in, uh, well, I wouldn't say in dungeons, but while in your mine shafts, in those chests. It's really dark in here. But yeah, I've literally, I've probably spent about hour, hour and a half trying to explore this area. Just completely. Hey, is that another one? Oh, nope, just the same one. That's cool, though. Hey, what's this way? Oh, I did go the same. I am retarded, yeah. I just went around a complete circle. Which is cool, because I was kind of wanting to work my way back this way anyway. Ha ha ha. In the door. Walking through, walking through. But before I had completed this, this whole area used to be open. I just covered it up, cleaned it up. It used to be dirt, stone everywhere. Cleaned it up and just made this little entrance. So I just like the way it looks. But the other entrance I had is you take this way and you can take the rocks down here. I made signs, but I misdirected myself. Pig! Yeah. Oh, I wonder if that's why they're spawning up here. I, ha I have not seen this before. I think it's... Wow. I think, that's why they're spawning. Oh. Okay, now that makes sense. I haven't been up here and I was wondering how all these animals, or friendly mobs, are getting in here. But now I know because they're spawning up there and then coming down here. And it's dark down here. And look, we have more iron. Ha ha ha. Let's see. What else we got? Oh, God. Creeper. Bitch. Yeah. I win. Let's see. What else is down here? And that was a completely pointless. I hear spiders. Why do I hear spiders? I kind of have a feeling there's a spawner around here somewhere. Come on, come on. I hear them, but I don't see them. But my inventory is full. That's encouraging. Oh, one thing I noticed that if you look at this, you're wondering what the food is of so the 16 on it. It's actually the new uh, cooked pork chop um, graphic. They actually... This is actually steak now. The old pork chop look is now for steak. Which actually kind of makes sense. I hear spiders and I want to know where they're coming from. I'm not sure if you guys can hear this. If it's recording. Because this is my first time using quick time to record. But I am hearing some major spider action going on. I would really, really, really like to know where it's coming from. Um, yeah. That sounds like I'm getting closer. Yeah, I think I am getting closer. So, yeah, guys, um, 
tell me what you think of the new um, 1.8 pre-release, what your expectations are uh, for future updates after 1.8. Um, I don't know exactly. You guys are probably more creative than I am with this kind of stuff. All I do is play the game. But if you guys have any good ideas, share with me. I'll talk about them. Um, maybe. Whoa, that was a mistake. Let's not do that. Um, may get you to. I I do play on PC. It for people that wanna that wanted to know. I play on PC and on Mac. I'm PC. I'm probably gonna be using it to make my um dual comms. If I can't find a decent audio or Skype recording program for Mac. But, um, otherwise, yeah, I'm going to be doing it on my PC. If you guys have any suggestions, oh my gosh, literally these, hey look, iron. Abundance of iron, win. I'm going to complete a different direction, they, the sun is still getting stronger. Oh my gosh, it's so strong now. I don't want to keep you guys... Oh, hey, look, more iron. Yeah. Sounds like there might be a spawner down here. Is that it? Oh. The little bastard ones. Damn you. Did you see that one peeking through? Bad spider. Bastard. Oh my god, dude. There, there's a ton of them. What the f- Coming from freaking trees, what the hell? Oh, there you are. There we go. There's probably more, so. What's the whoa, stop freaking sprinting. I'm really sick of sprinting. Hello, zombie. And by a person. And creeper. That's really encouraging. Let's see. Find a way to get down there. Uh huh. Looks like I'm digging my way down. Or just dropping in. That works too. Come here. Creeper. I'm trying to keep my eyes open for this thing. There you are. Got him. Cool. Cool, cool, could you? First time. And a crash. That is the first crash I've had since 1.8b2. I guess that's a good place to stop my video. Alright, thanks for watching. And leave a comment, rate, and subscribe, do what you want, don't care, I'm making videos as I want to, peace.